Well, it was worth a try. And this is locked in place right now. I used the um, the green a locked tight locking compound. It's called sleeve retainer, designed to retain sleeves on uh, crankshafts. It's also used to retain gears on motor shafts and uh, that's pretty good stuff if it gets a good a good bond now this thing had quite a gap in it but I put some of that stuff in there spun it around to uh, work it in real well and then let it sit overnight and then the next day I put some in here as well so it's been treated on both sides and right now it seems pretty solid of course I'm only working it with my fingers but I'll put it back together put a prop on it and see what happens if it stays tight it'll be a good spare motor if it doesn't maybe I'll just use it on the test stand for testing different uh, props on the unique motor so anyway I just wanted to uh, update everyone and show that uh, when you have access to the underside as well as the top side you can get enough chemical uh, retaining compound in there that might actually uh, do the trick and in fact this is what the factory could do while uh, assembling these things they could use that green fastening uh, chemical in there as an added extra measure of insurance against these things coming undone. Okay, later.